Hunger is a 2023 Netflix movie focused on a girl who accepts the prestigious offer for a position on a renowned cooking team called Hunger. We follow Aoi's journey before, during, and after Hunger. The movie focuses on the craving for food and purpose in life, so much so that the desire intoxicates you. It provokes you to question your contentment as she was questioned hers. She became successful and felt the impact of it. She could have had her success and a balanced life if her hunger had not intoxicated her. The movie starts off very strong and continues in some parts, but I felt the strength should have been present in the end. It is a good watch with appealing cinematography and topics to consider in terms of purpose, classism, and cooking. There's something brutal yet calming, tense but satisfying about the cooking and atmosphere. I feel like the ending was prolonged, therefore, making it seem ineffective. I was also a bit confused about who to root for at the end. Everything seemed like a lot. They wrapped up the restaurant section quickly, despite Taz being the type of person who would never allow her to walk away freely, or without an ironclad contract. Paul was not wrong. He would be out soon and still sought after as sad as it seems, which is why he was so unfazed. No charges to the dang who stabbed him? So, water under the bridge, I guess. Come to think of it, he didn't seem as affected by it almost as if he's not surprised it happened either. So was Tino not really moved by the Tucon capture? Or he was moved, but still recorded it in case. Chef Paul had absolutely no redeeming quality lol. I thought he would have a soft spot and smile or something, but no. He was cold till the end, which in my opinion was a good twist. A true villain, if you ask me. I kept waiting for it, or to at least see a moment of sheer happiness from his past. But no, we got a bit of his backstory to understand why he's like this, and that's all. It's just a girl, her walk, and her dreams navigating different social circles. She's been a rich chef and a poor chef, but unlike Jordan from 2013's Wolf of Wall Street, she chose poor. I mean, technically she didn't. She was sort of forced to after they cornered and had Chef Paul arrested. She saw more of how superficial yet cutthroat the industry is. She realized she could grow to blur the lines or become shoved aside when her time came. So really, she didn't need to be special. And that's my review of Netflix's 2023 movie, Hunger. Written on my Medium and Vocal account.